Hey guys, name is Marcin and this is the new Kaiser Domin Mini in dual color G10. Uh, I haven't seen this knife on YouTube yet so I decided to record a quick overview for you guys to help you decide whether it's a good purchase or not. And long story short, yeah, this is a good purchase. So uh, let's start with a quick size comparison. Uh, this is the CVV Elementum we all know and love. This is the Benchmade Bugout. This is the full version, so it's significantly, significantly larger knife. And quite a good comparison, this is Rat Model 2 quite the same and last but not least this is the old domain old new because this is the old hardware old design but new material which is the micarta this is the 2020 re release but inside it's the same as the old g10 version so as you can see there's a significant reduce of uh, size for the mini version but that's not all the changes there's a lot of uh, changes inside the knife so the old one had phosphor bronze washers and even though i am sometimes fan of the washers because because they can get smooth this is not there yet and it definitely wasn't smooth out of the box this was a thumb killer very hard to uh, activate not so smooth, it needed a lot of lubrication. It's getting better with use, but it's not there yet. So I like Kaiser's PB washers, but not in this knife. In the glider, it was way better than here. This, on the other hand, uses the bearings. So this is the standard Kaiser uh, ceramic bearings in uh, plastic cages. And this is smooth out of the box really can't complain flies out like crazy goes down easily it's not drop shotty per se but yeah pretty much perfect for us such a small knife so this is the main uh, improvement for some for some maybe not but i'm not a hard user so i like my bearings the other huge improvement for me is the pocket clip this is the old one standard one not deep carry and it's so damn tight it's really not good a clip definitely not a good clip this on the other hand is way more refined first of all i like deep carry this is a deep carry as deep as the design allows it to be and if you can see yeah fully recessed screws on this one so this is a below $50 knife this is not something you can take for granted in such a budget another difference is that it's inside the handles so it has a little cutoff here it was on the handles not not perfect and it's double-sided so not a tip down or only a tip down i shall say but uh, those lefties can use it well as well so this is a black stone wash it's not a coating i mean it's coated but also you could see the stone wash finish i very much like this blade good shape good for cutting of course very sharp out of the box can't complain
Is there any problems with it? I would say not really. Maybe those screws could be slightly more recessed, but it's not really a hot spot when you grip it. Good lockup, maybe 30%. Perfect centering, if you can see it. No play, no blade play, no lock rack whatsoever. Well made knives. The liners are weight relieved. So the, the weight is not, not big. I am not a fan of giving all the dimensions. This is easily to be found in the internet. So just Google that. So yeah, liner hold. Very nice one. Doesn't seem like a afterthought. Looks like a part of the design. The same as here. But some guys reported this, the, the, this part when made by Micarta. It's really thin. So it likes to break. G10 should be slightly more durable in this regard. So yeah. Easy recommendation from me. It's good size, good in hand, nice EDC little knife. I appreciate the changes for better. So Azo, good job on this one. I like the dual color, let's say, very popular nowadays, Stormtrooper-esque feel to it. Nice little knife. So yeah. Kaiser Domin Mini. Thanks guys, bye.